Tonight, we are now getting to hear some of the tense moments that were unfolding when a man repeatedly drove a truck into a television station in downtown Dallas. Michael Fry was arrested after police say that he crashed into the Fox 4 studios this morning with his truck. Yona Gavino live outside that television station tonight with what's new. Yona? Crews spent the day boarding up windows. You can see right behind me, the glass has been covered with those boards. And right now, Dallas police are out here keeping a close eye on everything. We got a major accident. One vehicle involved coming in at 400 North Griffin Street at the Fox 4 Studios. Police scanners detail an act that grabbed national headlines. Now we believe it is intentional. He is purposely ramming his vehicle now. Police say Michael Chadwick Fry smashed a rented pickup truck repeatedly into the Fox 4 studios during the morning news and tossed thousands of papers onto the ground. Random words and phrases, high treason and witchery scrawled on them. They were printed copies of news reports from a 2012 incident with Denton County Sheriff's deputies. They shot and killed a driver who was ramming into their cruiser. Fry was in the passenger seat. Court records show he's been booked into the Denton County Jail 27 times since 2003. Charges range from DUI to burglary, assault, and arson. This longtime neighbor asked us not to show her face. I was very shocked. I mean, he's a good kid. I can't believe he would do that. Residents tell us Fry lives with his mother in a trailer in Denton County. He's a good kid. I mean, he works hard. Takes care of his mom. When police arrested him, they said he was rambling and wasn't making any sense. I told him once, when you're on your meds, you're great. Now, luckily, no one was hurt. Most of the journalists were evacuated from the building right now. Fry has been charged with criminal mischief. Live in downtown Dallas, Yona Govino, CBS 11 News.